of course. Oh, I just hit. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck on the wall. I'm stuck. <laughs> wow. I couldn't get off the tire barrier. I was stuck. Well, I might as well repair. Well, caution's out now. Do I still make my pit stop? I wonder if I can still make... Yeah, I can still make my pit stop. Oh, I'm gonna be a lap down now, huh? Oh, no. Alright. Alright. Um. Um, what's going on? Are we waiting for all these cars to go by and then we go? I wonder if that's why. I think we have to wait till everyone drives on by. Okay, everyone's driven on by. Can we go? Are we literally stuck here? Am I literally stuck here? I, I is it? This is re oh my god. Well, we're stuck. So uh, yeah, this is uh, this is a turn of events. Oh come on now. This literally had to happen. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me, right? I'm stuck. <sighs> well, I'm gonna have to restart this race. Welcome to Delaware for the running of the MBNA Platinum 400 at Dover International Speedway. Now, Barney, this is one of the tougher tracks that we come to. Why is that? This place has got high bank concrete corners that can be really tricky for some drivers. You've got to always be thinking ahead in this race and planning your pass as well. Otherwise, you may quickly find yourself in the wall. How about the consistency shown by the MBNA car? Oh, yeah. To have an average finish in the top ten for the season is mighty impressive. It can often be the difference that wins the championship. Bobby Hamilton is towards the bottom of the points list this season. And how frustrating that must be. You're working just as hard as everyone else, yet you just can't seem to finish well on race days to gain the valuable points you need. These guys need a good finish just to regain their confidence as a team. Ken Schrader won Rookie of the Year honors in 1985. You know, it seems like Schrader's been competing in Winston Cup for so long that it's hard to believe he was ever a rookie. He's a class act, and it shows on the racetrack and in the garage area.
Welcome back to NASCAR Thunder 2003. Right now, I'm about to do race 13 to 36. I'm here at the Dover International Raceway here in Dover, Delaware, for the running of the NBNA America. MBNA Platinum 400, my bad. As you see on the starting lineup, I start on the pole. Got another pole this season. Uh, my sixth pole this season. Um, looks like lately I've been racking up a lot of poles, so, which is good. You know, it's good to start up front. Although, after my poor performance at Charlotte, I still have the points lead, but I did lose some points. I used to have a 155 point lead going into Charlotte. Then, after I wrecked on lap two with Sterling Marlin, I am now. By, I am now up by 125 points over Dale Earnhardt Jr. in the point standings. By the way, the assist, all of it, both stability control and auto brake is turned off. I'm not sure if I turned off stability control. So before I start this race, I'm going to check the assist to see if I turned them off. But, uh, but the stability control and auto brake will be off for this race. So here at Dover, Delaware, going racing. Hang on one sec. Let me, let me make sure. Let me... Oh, it is on. Let me turn that off. My bad there. Uh, sure, why not? Let's save the uh, settings real quick. Sorry, my bad for the delay, guys. But you know what? I mean, I, you know, I want the stability control to be off. Although this track is gonna be very slick and slippery, but I have a big point, big points lead, so I don't care. I don't want to win the championship by 125 points. So I thought I'd make it fun and just have all the assist off of this race, even if I wreck a lot. So here we go. This is the Monster Mile. It's gonna be a rough race. Here we go. Green flag is out. We are underway here at Dover. Wow, 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 this car is sideways already. First lap, oh yeah, this car wants to wreck. Oh, I'm not gonna lead the first lap. Almost did. Oh, Dale Jerry did lead the first lap. I'm in the wall already, that's not surprising. Uh-oh, I'm about to go in the wall again. Oh, I'm in the wall again. Oh, and now it's three wide, what is this, guys? Oh yeah, I'm gonna fall back now, cause, oh. Yep, this is going to be a fun race because I am sideways all over the place and this is the Monster Mile. This track is very slippery because it's concrete. It's not uh, asphalt. Oh boy. Yeah, this is going to be one interesting race, one sideways race. Should be fun though, but uh, <laughs> bad, bad at the same time, I am... Uh-oh. Oh my god. Gosh, am I all over the place? Oh, I got in the back of Mark Martin. That was my fault. I braked a little late. <laughs> oh my god, I would love to get at least get to the bottom lane. However, if I do get to the inside lane and happen to slide up the racetrack, I won't have to hit anybody. Oh, but if Mark does that to me, yep. Oh my gosh, I am. Oh. Man, you, this is why I run stability control on, guys, because of this issue. Oh! Okay, I just... Oh, gosh! Okay, I decided to back off there. I didn't want, I didn't want to make it three wide, but it cost me to hit the wall. Yeah, I'm going to hit the wall a lot in this race. I'm going to tell you right now. I'd rather be three wide on the inside lane than on the outside lane. Oh! Underneath Bill Elliott and Mark Martin, I do take the fourth spot away. You see that I'm running a different paint scheme and sponsor. Uh, MBNA is the sponsor for this race, so that's why I have the MBNA sponsor and the green and white car. Not a bad color, I will say. Not a bad mix of color with green and white. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Underneath Jeff Burton to try to take the second spy away. Oh my gosh. I am just almost making contact. Yeah, this is going to be one hell of a race. Oh yeah. And can't wait till I get worn tires in this race because that's going to be really bad. Worn tires are really not good here at Dover. Oh, 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 oh. All right, got the race lead. 
Now, can I get five bonus points for leading a lap? I, I, I haven't gotten the five bonus points yet. Oh yeah, I'm gonna have them right here. Five points can make a difference in winning a championship. Oh my gosh, I am just... So far, you know, despite on how sideways I am in some of these corners, I do have a fast car. And you know, a few people have told me, you know, running auto brake and stability control turned off, your, fat, your car is, is faster. And they are not wrong. Oh goodness, I am sideways, man. 30 laps to go. Oh yeah. I'm trying to pull away. I got a three tenths of a second lead over Jeff Burton. I, I would say that was a good corner. I arced... I, went up the track in turn one and then arced it down in the corner in turn two. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I'm, oh no. Oh yep. Here comes the tires Warren. I was... I thought that was going to happen. As soon as my car... Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. This is... Oh boy. This is going to be fun now. Warren tires. This is going to be a lot of fun. <laughs> oh turn. Uh, yep. I'm going to lose the race lead right here, maybe. Oh! Not quite yet. I do get the run off the corner, so that's been my advantage all season long, is getting the runs off the corner. Oh, I'm in the wall. Didn't break hard enough. Oh! No! I tried. I tried to get on the brakes. I was like, well, it did not work. Oh my gosh, that was not my intentions of getting in the Jeff Burton right there. I was just trying to get the race lead, pass him underneath, and I just went up the track into him. Not my intentions to hit him out of the way. Oh gosh, sideways, don't. Oh my gosh. Alright, 25 laps to go. I'm going to pin around lap 20. None of the drivers have pitted yet. Tell you what, I still have a strong race car despite how sideways I am. Some drivers are heading down pit road right now. Oh, side by side with Bill Elliott for the race lead. On earth, problem is my car is tight going in the corners. All right, Bill Elliott's. Oh, wow, that was that was as sideways as you can get without spinning the race car. Low on fuel. All right, I'm pitting. I'm pitting this time by. All right, so coming down pit road. All right, Jeff Burton, you can pass me. Here, I'll just let him go. It's not like... All right, I'm not going to fix the damage. Uh, yes, get tires. Gonna need tires. And let's have a clean pit stop. We got a car that can win this race. I'm trying to go for my fifth win of the season. Whoa, what the? What was that? Did you see that? I glitched into Bobby Hamilton. Whoa, that was amazing. All right, so far so good. All right. Good pit stop. Oh, oh, what the? All right. All right. Oh, okay. Sideways still. 
Oh my gosh, okay, thank god I'm off the apron. I should- If I knew I was that sideways, I should have gone back on the track a lot sooner. Alright, so now with fresh tires... It's time to go. And some more drivers off the road. Wow, am I really not going to have to race- Oh! Oh, okay, okay, oh, okay, okay, Kurt, uh, I was trying to stay off him, and he kept coming down or something, or I came up, I don't know, I was trying to, st oh, oh my gosh, holy crap, <laughs> this car is all over the place, oh my goodness, this car is terrible, oh, well, what, what is this up here, who came across the racetrack in front of traffic, is, uh, is that Ricky Rudd? I think it's Ricky Rudd. He just came across the racetrack in front of us. Almost caused a wreck up here. Alright, now it's time to, uh... Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. Joseph. Please not wreck the car. We're having a good solid top 10 run. Well, I guess I'm not gonna be, uh, not gonna be the race leader. As I was before pitting. So 17 laps to go in this race. Oh my gosh, my car is just as sideways as it can be. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh no. Okay. You know, Dale Jerry came into this race third in points. I'm, I think he is the leader, but I'm not, I don't, I don't know. No, who is that up there? No, it's not Dale Jarrett, huh? It could be Jeff Burton or, uh, Bill Elliott. No, Bill Elliott was back here. Bill Elliott must have had a terrible pit stop as well. Oh, goodness, I am just still sideways. Fifteen laps to go. So... Depends on where Junior is at. I'm still gonna maybe gain some points, maybe. Oh no! Don't do that. Oh, I would love if you would stop doing that. <laughs> All right, Yolo, three wide. Let's do it. Oh, oh, Yolo, Yolo. Oh, get the run off the coin. Yes. Oh no! Too much Yolo. Too much. Oh no. Alright, um, I'm gonna stay down here. Alright, yeah, I'm just... Don't, don't back up across traffic. Don't back up across traffic. Don't... Okay, thank gosh. Well, that was too much YOLO. <laughs> I did a little bit too much. Oh, well... I mean... So much for a top ten. That did not work. I, I, I You know what, actually... Oh, whoops. Actually, it all right. I'm gonna get four fresh tires. Actually, it did work, but uh, yeah, it did work. But uh, I, I, I mean, I passed both uh, Ricky Rudd and Dale Jarrett. I mean, I did it. I passed them, but unfortunately, uh, did not succeed towards the end of it. So I'll get four fresh tires here. Oh, that means I'm gonna have fresher tires than everyone else. I'm gonna be in 43rd, but uh, you know what? I'm gonna gain a lot of spots here because I'm gonna have the fresher tires than, they, than everyone else in this race. So obviously I'm not gonna go for my fifth win of the season and obviously not going to uh, finish in the top 10, but uh, that means I'm gonna lose some points as well. So I would say that spin was all my fault. I yoloed it too much. Mm -hmm. All right, ten laps to go in this race. Who's the race leader? Jeff Burton. I just wanted to check who the race leader was. That's all. Oh man! All right, time to pass some cars. Get out of my way. You gotta get out of my way. I have the fresher tires, so I'm gonna pass these guys a lot quicker. Yeah, but I'm already passing them because I got the fresher tires. Mm, my gosh. Okay. Oh, I got in the back of Steve Park. 
So it's going to be two races in a row that I'm going to run into some trouble on that I spun out. I spun out Charlotte, and now I spun out here. Oh, goodness. Eight to go. All right, up to 36, so I grabbed seven spots in two laps. Eight now, and now it's going to be nine spots. Yeah, see? See what fresher tires do for you? Craven, did I have a jam on the brakes there? He came down the track in front of me. I did not expect that one. All right, underneath Shauna Robinson, Jeff Purvis. Oh, don't go on that apron. All right. Oh yeah. Oh man. Wow, am I picking up a lot of spots? That's what fresh tires would do for you. 26. I moved up 17 spots in 5 laps. That is amazing. And I'm still moving up spots. All right, almost got in the back of Bobby Labonte because he came down in front of me. Like a doofus. 5 laps to go. I did not, okay, I knew I was going to pick up several positions in the final 10 laps, but I didn't think I was going to pick up 20 positions. I'm in 21st already. That is amazing. Four to go. Oh, no. Oh, no! I almost spun the car out again. That would have sucked. After all that, uh oh, someone's blowing the motor up here. Who is that? Oh, but he's gonna cause a wreck. Oh, I had to really jam on the brakes there. Everyone slowed down, and I had to slow down. I got in the back of. Oh, it was Bill Elliott that blew the motor. That's too bad because he was running in the top ten. Three laps to go in this race. So almost a disaster, almost a big wreck because Bill Elliott. Everyone was slowing down because Bill Elliott was blowing the motor. No. Oh. Three white for 14th. Two laps to go. Oh, please don't spin. Gosh, I got a fast race car. It's too bad I'm not up there. There's Dale Nye Jr. Remember, he came in second in the point standings. I'm about to pass him right now. White flag is up. Oh! White flag. I'm up in 13th. All right, yellow, pass up on the outside. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, I almost came straight down to Rusty Wallace. Well, it looks like I'm going to grab a 12th place finish. But I will say, after that spin, after being in 43rd, I came back to finish 12th. Checker flag. I think Jeff Burton won, but I finished Yep, Jeff Burton wins the NBA Platinum 400 here at Dover. Very many caution laps in this one. Well, I'd say the fans would probably have liked to see more excitement. I'm sure the drivers, on the other hand, were happy about the low number of caution flags. From all of us here at EA Sports at MRN, thanks for joining us today. Next up is Pocono. Well, that sucks. All right. Show jump. <coughs> My bad. Jeff Burton wins the NBA Platinum 400 here at Dover. Rick, Ricky Red second, Tony Stewart third, Sterling Martin fourth, Jeff Gwynn fifth, Kevin Harvick tenth, Kurt Busch eleventh, I finished twelfth, Russ Wallace thirteenth, and Dale Nightshire fourteenth. So, wow. Okay. You know, despite me, see, um, few people told me that running without any assist, you run, you, your car is faster if you have assist turned off. They were not wrong. I went from 43rd to finishing 12th in the final 10 laps. That's a lot of position. So, point standings. <laughs> wow, okay. Despite, um, wow. I thought I lost points, but uh, I guess I gained some more points. I gained uh, 11 points. 
So I came into the Dove race with a 125 point lead. Now, at, even after the troubles I've had with spinning the car, I, I gained some points. I now have a 136 point lead over Dale Jarrett and Dale Nye Jr. In fact, Dale Jarrett and Dale Nye Jr. are tied for second in points. Rusty Wallace, fourth points, 216 back. Jeff going round at the top five in points, uh, 249 back. And Ryan Newman rounds up the top 10 in points, 318 back. So, surprisingly, I gained points even though I was having trouble. I mean, I had a winning car, but uh, yeah. Alright, so the next race is going to be at Pocono Raceway for race 1436 for the running up the Pocono 500. I will see you guys up in the mountains at Long Pond, Pennsylvania at Pocono.